Hello and welcome to Logic ERP. This video will help you to understand the process of creating account groups in Logic ERP. In the main menu, click on Setup, Setup Accounts, then Setup Account Groups. In this window, you can see that 10 general groups are available, out of which two are balance sheet groups. Each group has five levels. Let us create an account group. Right click on the group to rename it. Enter the desired name of the group. On level 1, we will create areas. Right click on level 1 to rename it. Now click on Refresh to create the names of different areas. Go to Column Attributes and remove the columns that are not required. Start typing the name of area and select the accurate group type. If the grouping is being done for customers, then select customer here. You can also log billing for a particular group based on due and overdue bills. Similarly, keep on creating as many groups as required. We will fast forward this video and quickly create 10 groups under level 1. After creating all the groups, click on Save. Expand the group to see the areas created under it. Now we will create agents on level 2. Type the name of agent and select the appropriate group type. Create as many agents as needed. Then, click on Save. Agents have been created at Level 2. At Level 3, we will create Days of the Week. The process will remain the same as Level 1 and 2. Similarly, you can go on to create groups at level 4 and 5. After creating all the groups, we will now move towards allocation. Select the area name and click on allocate. Select the customers who belong to the selected area. Selected customers have been allocated under Sector 1. You can also right-click on the particular group to allocate accounts. Similarly, Allocate the customers in other groups as well. One account cannot belong to more than one group. You can allocate 
the accounts in all the groups in this way. We will now allocate the areas to different agents. Select the agent and choose those areas which you want to allocate to that agent. Do this for all the agents. One area cannot be allocated to more than one agent. Agents will further be allocated into different days of the week. Follow the same process for allocation as we did in the previous levels. You can allocate the agents or salesmen into all the days of the week in this way. You can also set order of the groups or accounts allocated in those groups. Just select the group and click on refresh. Now go to set order. Make use of the arrows to change the order as per your choice. Similarly, you can create more groups on other available general groups. All the groups have five levels each. Apart from this, two balance sheet groups are present here by default. You can add more groups if required. All the accounts are allocated in one or the other balance sheet group. You can deallocate the accounts if you want to change their balance sheet group type. Just tick the account and press OK. Let us see how to deallocate. Suppose that you wrongly allocated Agent 1 into Monday instead of Wednesday. Click on Monday and go to Deallocate. Select Agent 1 and press OK. Now click on Wednesday and allocate Agent 1 into it. You can do this on every group level. Thank you for watching this video. For more software related updates, kindly subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell icon.